Welcome to the Town of Hinton Water Wednesday Water Safety Tip. This week is boat safety. All smart boaters know, everyone wears their life jackets, boat sober, drive with extreme caution and with proper lights after dark, drive at moderate speed, know before you go, know the local hazards and the expected weather, have the right gear, use a simple safety checklist, tell someone your plans and when you expect to return. Did you know, children under 16 years of age are not permitted to operate a personal watercraft. Children under 12 years of age must be accompanied by an adult to operate a boat with a motor of more than 30 kilowatts or 40 horsepower. Anyone born after 1983 must have a pleasure craft operator card to operate any size power boat. Anyone operating a powerboat under 4 meters in length, including personal watercrafts, must have a PCO card. Get carded. Obtain your pleasure craft operator card by taking a Life Saving Society boat course or by studying at home using a boat study guide. And take the test at one of our boat test centers. Boat safety is crucial. Your boat checklist should include the following. Bailing bucket, oars or paddles, Whistle, flashlight, life jackets or PFDs, throw rope, first aid kit, tools, spare parts, extra fuel. Get the right stuff. The length of your boat determines the quantity and type of safety equipment that is required on your pleasure craft. Don't overload your craft. Avoid swamping or capsizing by following the load restrictions. This includes the number of passengers and the weight of your gear. Choose it and use it. Trying to put on a life jacket in an emergency is like trying to put on your seatbelt during a car crash. Don't just leave your life jacket in the boat, wear it while enjoying the water. Always boat sober. Boating and boozing don't mix. The greatest danger of boating is the one the driver can control, alcohol consumption. Alcohol affects balance, judgment, and reaction time. Piloting your boat while under the influence is not only dangerous, but a criminal offense. Operating a boat comes with a hefty fine of $600 with a second conviction leading up to 14 days in prison. You can also lose your driver's license even as a first time offender. Thanks for tuning in for our weekly Water Wednesday. See you next week.